So uh, we were talking earlier. Wait, were you? What's Rooney's last role? Like, cause we we met you officially through Indiana. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And do you know the whole thing about Indiana and, and what we do? Did she tell you anything about it? She just said you guys are like friends, and I was like, yeah. "Get me on their podcast. They're funny." <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, no, Indy's. Uh, yeah, Indy's one of our closest friends down here for sure. But the whole thing was we were talking about it earlier, and I was watching you on Rooney's last role with Indy, and you guys had like the whole like being together thing in terms of your characters. And the whole joke is that Chris simped over Indy when we were hella small on Cap. TikTok, and then she saw it, and that's how we first started like talking. Oh, so, so like, we just fuck on that, yeah. So you guys met because he simped for her it, on accident, yeah. yeah. It was yeah. not on, on accident. accident. <laughs> you did it like simp. what? Probably ten simp times. Like, no, I, I okay. It was it was a slight simp, you know. It, 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 <laughs> slight simp. How do you slight simp? <laughs> okay, yeah, I, I simp, but you know. Simped. I saw the TikTok of her rejecting. That was funny. <laughs> <laughs> Simped dash still is simping. I, I say I rejected her in that TikTok. Honestly. No, wh- which wait, wait which TikTok? World? Which TikTok? Uh, like I, I'll name twenty off yeah, top of my head uh, right now. <laughs> There's footage on Hollywood Fix of his arm around and then her yeah, doing a quick yeah. roll out. <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't put that part in. <laughs> I want that. I want that video to be gone off the internet forever. <laughs> But I think Chris needs to take from you because in the because uh, it's oh. it's a chicken girls film, right? Like that's like that's what. I mean, like I guess they're making like a whole Marvel universe type beat because they just everything connects. I like don't know. somehow. Yeah, like different universes. <laughs> like, I'm literally in Attaway, and that somehow connected to Rooney's last role, and that somehow connects to Chicken Girls. I don't know, man. <laughs> it's like a whole universe that Brat made. So how did you even get into that? Like, my manager just was like, "Yo, you want to be on uh, the show with Indiana?" And I was like, "Indiana, sure, yeah." Do you have any past acting experience or did you just hop on it? I mean, like, I took drama in high school, you know, and, like, I want to be an actor. So I was like, yeah, but I'll that, do it. That know? shit's huge. It's like a YouTube show, right, that has a ton of, like, it has a huge fan base. Yeah, for me, it, it was, like, a big deal. It was like, oh, my first ever acting gig, you know? Right. Even though sure. it's, like, for a YouTube show, it's still, like, like there's still cameras, directors. You know what I mean? It was it was cool. It was, it was dope. Did you have to audition for it? Is it, like, did they, they are, like, you have the following, too. It's, it's a lot of influencers. No, they just kind of were like, yo. Here, it just gets like, you. Sure. <laughs> Dude, what, what's that it. process like of being on a show like that? Like with with a ton of influencers, it's made for YouTube. What's what are, what's it like? Um, to be honest, it's a lot like just a regular film set for a regular show, movie, whatever. Like you know, you have your own room, your own changing room. There's a snack bar. Like the snacks were the best part. There's a table of just way too yeah, many yeah. snacks. Way too many snacks, and you know. They'll call you when your scene's coming up. You have your uh, a script. I don't know what to call it. I forgot what it's called, but it's pretty much like a regular show, honestly. That's sick. Yeah. Well, dude, um, what is it like? I mean, low-key, like with Attaway General and that coming out too, like it blew up. And what I noticed is like, I first heard about it from people like my age making jokes about it and calling it like cringe and shit. Like, yeah. they, dude, parts of it are, are, I mean, but they're made for a different audience. But it has like, there's no there's not a lot of dislikes it's like 30,000 likes and a million views every single episode it carries on YouTube I didn't realize that until I really checked it out yeah like Griffin came home and I was like bro this comment section's ripping you in half yeah and he's just <laughs> like you know what it's getting views I'm getting a bag it's a win-win I was like I mean if you're getting a bag it's always a win yeah, like, like, I, I, like no matter what you do in most cases well, yeah in most there's cases. a few cases where it doesn't doesn't quite hold up like that <laughs> what cases are those like we talked about <laughs> I, well, I'm, I'm trying thinking, to think um I mean, uh, I Chris and Kyle I launched an OnlyFans. Yeah, that's that, what that I was saying. I respect an OnlyFans grind, you know. An OnlyFans grind is it's one of those ones that's like a hard one to stomach at first, but then I think after you see the money that you can get from it, it's, it's probably the way to go. Have you yeah. have you thought about OnlyFans? Do you have an no, OnlyFans? No, I mean, I already got leaked, so I was like, you got leaked. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what is it? What's Actually, the story of that? What is getting liked all uh, getting that leaked all like over? A year ago. Tell me the story. I fuck, I don't know. Wait, what got leaked? Just got everything got leaked. Oh, <laughs> was just was just cock shot or like should what? We, should we bring this? Should I bring this back up to the internet? I don't know if I want to bring this back up. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, that's cra- that's crazy. I mean, it already happened. I, yeah, I, yeah. I none of have is anyone here. I don't think anyone here is. The seen. best part is laughing at, at it after. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you know, <laughs> cock shot, bro. Cock, hey, it'll do it to you. I mean, it happens. <laughs> was your face in it? No. Okay. Oh. Good. All right. So then you could have just denied it from yeah. the beginning, right? <laughs> well. Now, <laughs> now. <laughs> Why could you deny it? Because there was like a mirror pic, you know, but like my face is covered. But then it's like, oh, oh so yeah, it was oh, like, oh, yeah. You know, that's a bummer, Damn. man. Hasn't happened to me. Yeah, hopefully won't. 
<laughs> was it rough or it's like it, it just got over it? What's that Honestly, like? my DMs were kind of flooded. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, I was like, why am I getting more DMs than I was before? Mm-hmm. I was like, hmm. I mean, I guess that's a good sign. Yeah, I was like, I guess they like. <laughs> I don't know, man. Did it get leaked, like hacked, or is it like how does that happen? Because like, you see that happen all the time with celebrities, but like, it's not see, like you send it out. I to, think like, I think it just like. Like, I sent it to someone, and then I don't know what the fuck they did with it, but they they swear to God they didn't leak it. And I'm like, how the fuck? Like, it was too Yeah, weird, yeah, you know? yeah. I was like, so she must have, like, shit, like something must have happened, you know? Like, something. Damn. All right, okay. And so you're from Washington, too, from Olympia. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we're from Redmond. Do you know where that is? Yeah. I yeah. I had okay. a few games there. Yeah. So, um, dude, it's crazy how different, like, we were talking about earlier, but how different people are back back home versus in LA. Oh, hundred percent. Yeah. Dude, everyone in LA is so just money driven and right. like just focus on themselves. It's kinda crazy. I'm like when I go back home, I'm like, damn, everyone's a bum. I love it. You know? Yeah. But then when I come here, it's like I'm like nervous to like go out in public just yeah. because it's just so intimidating half the time. Wait, what, like fans coming up? No, just like I feel like if I do one misstep, it's going to be like everywhere, you know? Cause really? I, I remember, um, when I was with Olivia, like I'm also with her, I was in LA and I went out. Um, I don't know if it was with Holly or somebody else, but I was with, like, it was just me and a girl and Melrose and some fans asked for some photos and I was like, yeah, yeah, sure. Go for it. And then one of the girls was like hanging back, not like want to take a photo. I was like, is she like, okay. Like I asked her, is she okay? And then she's like, I just think your girlfriend would like to know about this. I'm like, whoa. I'm like, whoa. I'm like huh? And she's like, what are you doing with her? <laughs> what? Well, I'm the like, fuck? this girl's like 10 years old. And she's oh. roasting me. I'm like, like, I felt like I was in the wrong there. I was like, what do I do? Now? What do you even That's say a, to that? Yeah. What do you even? Yeah. I'm like, fuck you, gremlin. Like, <laughs> what do I say to that? Like we're just friends. Like fuck off. Like well, yeah. And it's just not her place. And she's ten. So yeah. it, uh, like, there's just so many factors that play into that not being okay. Yeah, I'm like, well, like I, I'm on Melrose, like the yeah. busiest street I could possibly go to. Like, am I am I in the like? I started questioning. Was am I in the wrong here? Like, yeah, are you in the wrong for going out and like just enjoying your life. <laughs> yeah, and then and then like I, I literally texted. I was like, Olivia, am I like am I in the wrong here? And she's like. You told me you were going out, dumbass. With like, I know <laughs> this isn't. You're not. Fuck. And they made you like question that though, weirdly. Yeah, I was like, am I an asshole? Like, am I? Yeah. You know what I mean? I was like, it was so weird. But that's what I'm saying. Like, things like that are in LA. It's just like, I feel like back home, I can just relax. Yeah. Just not care, and do whatever. How do you think the? Uh, how do you think the kids that like came up to you and they're asking those? Do you think to them, like watching like you and Olivia back then, was like their like the Britney Spears and Justin like th- that's what they cared about most it was like this is the, this is my shit that I watch every single day and that's what kind of made that happen I'm not even gonna cap I still get comments to this day like I miss Olivia and Keo like yeah. they swear to god we were like that one true pair or like we were gonna end up getting married and it's a little depressing cause I'm like bro we're not getting back together like you yeah. can stop commenting but they've made some edits there was an edit that got like 200k likes or something of me and Olivia like two weeks ago and I'm like, bro, it's been almost it's, a yeah. year. <laughs> like, that's they, fucking crazy yeah. that we were talking about that a year ago. That's crazy. And then p- the people are still bringing it up now all the time. Yeah, I'm like, bro. And like, even. You're good. On. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sometimes it just oh, yeah. like, <laughs> it, went, it, gets, it goes limp. It goes limp. It goes full yeah. limp. There, yeah. You just gotta like, it, you just have to like go like this. No, like, I don't even know. You just have to like kind of. Yeah, 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 so, um, how, how do you think you like eventually just kill a social media relationship? Like, like if it's so it's impossible, so, it's like a thing, right? Like it's I mean, impossible it's, to do that, honestly. Like, like you just like it's like when like, like the Brad Pitt and Angela Jolie still get brought up to this day. It's like that's very it's true. Like once you go public with someone and you're on social media and you're big on social media, good luck trying to kill that relationship because there's always gonna be some diehard fans still crying like they were meant to be, yeah. they were soulmates. Yeah, and like when I posted with. The first time I posted with another girl after breaking up, the comment section was like, how can you do this to Olivia? Like, all this shit. I'm like... Because it feels like they live your your day-to-day life, but they don't know the half of it. So, like... Oh, they don't even know, like, 80% of it. It's it's, it's, it's weird. I'm like... What do you think the biggest things are that people just don't see? You know? Everything. Yeah. It's like, what you see on social media is probably 
below 5% of how someone actually is. And like, there's so many things you don't know happening behind closed doors. Like, I know it's so cliche to say that, but it's just so true. It is. Yeah. Like, uh, like a good example is Chadwick Boseman, you know, the Black Panther right. actor. Like no one knew he had cancer, but they just roasted him for like getting all skinny out of nowhere. It's like, bro, you, you don't know what's happening. Just keep your mouth shut, you know? Mm. So I thought he was like, I, like personally, I thought it was like he was like like starving himself for like a role or something. And I didn't know he was like actually sick. Yeah, I know. And then like till he actually was like on his deathbed, I yeah. think. And then you're like, and everyone's like, oh, like, oh, shit. Fuck. You know? And that's right when everyone switches up, too. Because then exactly. everyone, like, right when that actually, like, right when that happens, then everybody's like, oh, shit, I'm going to stop being an asshole now. But it's like, you know, it's just like, it just takes one thing for everyone Dude, to even switch. Even now, like, James Charles and, like, Nikita tweeted about um, the baby. Oh, my God. That scene was crazy. And I'm just like, oh, God, like, this is about to blow up. And then baby's like, yo, can y'all chill? My daughter's like a fan of her. And I'm like, yeah. He I just he doesn't that. give a fuck, bro. He doesn't care. <laughs> I mean, right. it's just like it's like why would he? Like, like why, why rapper, would he bring JoJo Siwa into something? Like it, that would just be the most unsuspecting beef ever. There's, <laughs> there's no reason for it. The lyric didn't even rhyme. You the bitch, <laughs> JoJo Siwa, <a> bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine JoJo Siwa came back with like a diss track or something on the baby. That'd be fine. Nickelodeon Dude, sponsored. Did she even say anything back to? Did she? No, no. I don't think so. I don't I think doubt she, she cares. Yeah, <laughs> sitting on like cash. <laughs> she just throws it at the baby. <laughs> she throws some glitter at him. I. Why do you think everyone was so like focused on your guys' relationship? Because they were for sure. Like they, were, I still see like those videos all the time. Obviously, like you were saying, it's because it was like a high house sway house thing. Like, like don't you oh. Think? Well, like she went to Hype House after we went to LA, and then we like broke up. Yeah, so I don't know if it was. That. I think maybe it was just because I don't know. She was hot. Yeah, like, she was hot. I have some simps, and like we look good together. I don't know. Like, yeah, but I she mean, was facts. how it goes. Yeah, I mean that that's facts. I mean, like, I mean that's all I can really think of. It's like, and also because like you know, Sway member, like oh, Sway member's a girlfriend, you know, but. I don't know. I remember when I was, I think, like 15, I was obsessed with Summer McKean and uh, Dylan Jordan. Do you guys know who they are? Who's that? Like that? It doesn't matter. But, <laughs> but like, when they broke up, I felt like like I broke up with someone. I was like, bro, you guys are meant to be. So, yeah, when you're in that fan seat, it's, it's different from when you're actually in the, the front row. Yeah, I think maybe it's because they, like, wanted to, because in my experience, I wanted to be, like, Summer and Dylan because they would, like, travel together and, like, yeah. post together all the time. And I was like, dang, I wish I could do that. Oh, they're the couples vlogger. Right, they're a couple. They, they were, they they were, were like yeah, the biggest ones. I don't know if they were the biggest, but they were definitely really big. Okay, you know, like. And and then, remember, remember that YouTube channel? Like it was like boyfriend versus girlfriend. It was like oh, Jesse, like, Jesse. when they broke, I was like that hurt. That fucking hurt. Yeah, and I felt like I lost like two family members. Dude, when they broke up, I was like, no, like what do I do? I didn't know. What yeah. to do. I feel like that was my first ever experience in a breakup. It was like yeah. someone else's breakup. You're like crying about it. <laughs> this like, is fuck, so no more fuck. posts anymore. <laughs> Dude, I'm low-key like curious to see what that hot sauce they used in that one video was. Like she put it in the sushi. What? You know what I'm talking about? But she pranked him with a hot sauce that he used on her at one point. But she oh put a- I, yeah, I wonder if it was acted or actually like really hot because like there was wasn't she like choking? Bro, she had like some milk, some ice cream, and like yeah. she was red. If it was acting, bro, why the it, fuck are they no, not? No, no, I think it was that hot. There's some peppers. There's some hot sauce like across the seas that are actually nuts. Across the seas. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Over the seas? Overseas? What? It's just like there's there's domestic what? there's yeah. domestic hot sauce. Okay, well, I'm just saying that a like, lot of the hot like, sauce comes from where? Which country? It uh, comes from across the pond. Places, places. Okay? Across the pond. Yeah, across the pond. Just okay. say Asia and Mexico. You're safe. Asia and Mexico. There you <laughs> yeah. go. That's what actually what I was thinking too. So, <laughs> but like there's like there's like Carolina Reaper peppers, which are like the hottest. Ryan and I are from Carolina. Maybe. Carolina, like <laughs> North and South Carolina. Maybe we don't know. They are like it's proven. That's where they grow. Okay, whatever. I'm off this. I'm <laughs> off this. <laughs> it's not like up. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, p- spices everywhere. They're hot. Whatever. I get it. <laughs> yeah. Can we get Chris like one of those one chip challenge? Was like the hottest chip. Oh, those things the are Reaper fucking crazy. You see I'll the little do it. Do it? I'll fucking do it. I'll down it. <laughs> no, you won't. <laughs> yes, I would. Right, order that shit right I'll now. I'll down that. I want to see Chris. I want to see that come in the mail. I want to see Chris. Do I that. love spicy food. You kidding me? Come on now. Dude, if Lil Yachty couldn't handle it, I don't think you can. Lil Yachty's a... Say it. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he a bitch for that. I love him, though. I love you. If you ever see this, probably not. <laughs> if you ever see this, you're welcome on the podcast. Yeah, of course. Come on, you know. Lil Boat, Lil Chop. You know what I'm saying? <laughs>
Okay, so we were talking about this earlier, but so we made TikToks about you, right? And then we made yeah. we made t- TikToks about Olivia as well. You said you were laughing when when you saw him. I think she was the only person that did not fuck with the yeah, TikToks he made about like, her. How can you not find that funny? Like it's funny. I know. As fuck. <laughs> funny. Dude. Yeah. If you so we were at we were at like this like one house and she she was there and oh we like inter- we like some people like said hi to her, but like yeah. one guy that one Nathan he goes up to her and says hi, and they were like talking. Uh, she was with uh, Darianka. Darianka is that how you pronounce it? Dude, she corrects me all the time. It's, I think it's Darianka. 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 Okay, anyway. Uh, but <laughs> anyway, so so Nathan was talking to them, and it somehow got brought up that like he was part of the sink. Um, and then like instantly feelings change. She's like, oh, <laughs> we don't like you guys. And then yeah. she just dips. <laughs> <laughs> it's, dude, it was fun I've as fuck. heard stories of Olivia, like especially girls that are like associated with me. Yeah. She just doesn't like them. Mm-hmm. Like a Riley, she doesn't really like Indiana. She doesn't really like like any girls associate. She just doesn't like it's like especially girls I'm associated with. But like other people that have met her, they're like, yeah, she's just kind of rude to me. I don't know. Then some people say she's like the nicest person to them. She's got like mixed reviews. I don't know. <laughs> I have not seen the other side of the reviews. <laughs> it's like some people will swear she's like so nice, and others are like, nah, she's a dick. Dude, I'm like, what? I'm convinced that people just say that about literally everyone in their mama. I, they're like. Oh my god, they're the sweetest person, person in the world. It's like they could be the biggest bitch I've ever met. <laughs> Guy or girl. Like mm-hmm. literally, like they just suck ass. And like there's literally half the people that meet them just want to like please who they're talking to. Yeah. And they'll say, yeah. like, oh yeah, I love them. They're so sweet. That's I mean, wish you nice people here. like when you guys were together. I mean you you, you were with her a lot. When I was next to her, she was always nice yeah. to me. So like whenever she when like we broke up and everyone was like, Yeah, she's a, a bitch. And I'm yeah. like, really? Yeah, like it's you always, never like, saw your it. friends you always tell you after the breakup. Yeah, she was actually a bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, I didn't want to tell yeah, you about By the fuck way, her. you got played, you fuckhead. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, thanks for telling me four months ago. Yeah. <laughs> what, like, what do you think that she, is she just like the, what she says to girls or is it more just like... It's just the way she acts, I think. Yeah. She has just like a... I don't know. I, I haven't spoken to her in months, but like, I think from what I've heard, she just like... If she doesn't like you, she'll make it known. And she's going to leave it up to you to figure out why she doesn't like you. That's the best way I can put yeah. it. Yeah, Somebody that secretly hates you, but you don't know at all why. Yeah, you and know. You have to like really yeah. think about what could I have possibly done. Like for- you have to find out through her friends why she doesn't like you. Oh, you know? And then you find out it's the most dumb reason. It's like, fuck, really? <laughs> I mean, like some girls are obvious. Indiana, right? Like people should be like with them. Yeah. And they're going to be like, she's like, fuck them. You know, like they know why yeah. she doesn't like them. So it's all like just she doesn't want. She's just she doesn't want the idea of you with somebody else. I don't think she a fuck. I think she doesn't like them because she's like you know it's like like I'm not gonna like the guy that probably like she yeah. starts dating next. You know. Yeah. I mean, if yeah. I like him, I like him. If I don't, but like for her, I feel like she's just not gonna like them. Yeah. It's like someone else is dating your ex. Like I don't yeah. know. Yeah, I feel like it's just kind of like in the. Natural I feel thing. like it's just like an unwritten rule. It's like yeah, fuck them. I don't know who they are. Fuck them. <laughs> Dude, you just like can't like them. There's no way that you, the weirdest thing is when people are like friends with the the, the ex. Wait, it's it. the ex's new, like the, the ex's the boyfriend? new boyfriend yeah. or girlfriend. They're like friends with them. It's like why, dude? Try being okay. We're to- we're on good terms, right? But my ex in high school, I broke up with her, and my best friend and that her started dating. But I was like fine with it, and like I'm still best friends with them to this day. Can Are they still dating? They're still dating. So I mean, mm. now <laughs> I feel like it's fine because it's so far past. But like right when it happened, you had to be like a little bit like yo. No, I was like dope. Did he talk to you about it before he like asked well, her out? There's a, there's a difference, but I feel like for you, you can you can go on and find somebody else. You know, <laughs> like for uh, so for like, an average guy, like I'd say to myself, I'd be kind of pissed. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm an average guy. What do you mean I'm, I'm an average guy? I, I, okay, well, you have like you okay. the man. You got if, if we pull up in the beginning, right? Up, from doing looking over the shoulder and looking in the camera, I, people, I, guarantee, that got like I guarantee you, your insights is probably more, higher percentage of girls than guys. Actually, pull, I can't yeah, pull, pull up the yeah, insights. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious. I'm I curious guarantee you. you. Wait, we have to. Wait. I'm going. 87, 13. Yeah. 87 13. I'm going ninety ten. Okay, ninety ten. Ninety ten. It used to be pretty nuts. I'm not gonna lie, but I think it's gone down since how. Fuck you! Check insights again. Uh, you I go to your profile Instagram. and, uh, and then just click insights. Uh, Did you feel like I would fucking know this? <laughs> so I'm going. I'm going to 87, 87, 87 13. What are you going, Chris? What are you going, Chris? Uh, I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. 70, 30. 
Really? really? I don't that, think I'm giving it that leeway. 87 <laughs> female, 12% male. There Damn, that was right on. The <laughs> fuck. That's, That's crazy. crazy. Off that the what are you sitting at, Chris? What do you got? It's li- okay. So I know on Instagram it's seventy five percent dudes, oh. and then twenty four percent girls that I know. It's like it's like literally all dude fans. Dude, dude, it's legit a complete opposite. <laughs> yeah, Damn. and like. <laughs> So this is what we're saying when we say like you're not an average dude. Wow. Average dudes don't have 87. percent I'm at 60. I'm at 60 percent men, 40 percent female. Dude, oh, that's not bad. Fuck you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, it, and you also have to think how many followers you have. What like 3.5 million followers on Instagram? 2.5. But that's a lot of that's a lot yeah. of fucking women. <laughs> but you got to keep in mind how many of them are of age. True. Yeah. yeah. In like the United States, yeah, and are single, so that narrows it down. You know? True, it does narrow down, but that's two point. You're narrowing down from two million. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, we're narrowing so, down from twenty thousand, and then up that maybe 2, thirteen. 000. Like, <laughs> damn, I played myself with that. Chris has negative. <laughs> Chris has negative women that you can choose. <laughs> <laughs> I just gotta be truthful sometimes. <laughs> Chris has to start creating girls to find. <laughs> 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 He's ran out of his options. So he'll make, like, he'll I'll make, make an like account. An account. <laughs> <laughs> this, hey, this one's is Bethany, and then the DM myself. Like, this oh. one's perfect. It's a mixed photo of him in Indiana. I was like the profile. <laughs> Bro, speaking of those, those are kind of crazy. Like I did, I got some of those on my like um, uh, what I got tagged on. It's like weird edits of us on Hollywood Fix and like the screen switch ups and down, change colors and shit. Yeah, it's weird. Fan edits of you in Indiana, man. It's a whole new world. Keo, does he have a does he have a shot? Well, you have inside information with Indiana. I, we need to know. Like, what, the fans uh, need to know. The fans are. That's their real question. Like, Kai, uh, <laughs> like I'm like, I'm chilling. I'm just, I'm just right. chilling. I don't, he, know much, much, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know how much Indiana has told you about me and her though. What happened there? Oh, uh oh, we got a little uh, comment. Uh, I mean, uh, oh. hey, we went on a few dates, but like, hey, just let me know yeah. if I need to break it up over there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to see any fucking brawling at the table. <laughs> just let me know. Christmas like just slowly starts collapsing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, we went on a few dates and, like, Hollywood fixed, like, saw us, but... Oh, I remember It's that. just chill. I'm, just, I'm, I'm chill. I How serious I, I mean, yeah, we, like, kissed, like, once. I don't know. <laughs> like, dude, that's juicy. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not pissed. I'm chill. I'm, like, trying to get a reaction out of you. <laughs> Chris is going to take notes from you later. <laughs> I mean, like, was it, like, a French kiss or, like, just, like, a little, a little no. smooth? I, I'm just wondering. Chris under the, Chris you know, under the y'all, table Y'all right brought now. it this deep. This I'm is Chris under the table. Was it a French kiss? I really want to know if it was a <laughs> Yo, did you see the inside of her bedroom? What does it look like? <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, what does she uh, smell like? <laughs> Indiana, I'm so sorry. I'm so- <laughs> <laughs> Kai, fuck you. <laughs> Golly. She's going to see this and get like, she's going to text all you fucking like, what the Yeah, fuck? she's going to. Dude, there's be been pissed. so much worse than yeah, there's, there's been, w- yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Water, please. <laughs> water. I'm water. parched. <laughs> I need some water. <laughs> I want to talk about another thing. Uh, with everything that's happened, you were part of Sway before. And I know that Bryce said like Sway and everything. Did bar stools like Dave Portnoy and all that stuff? Did that end Sway? No. Right? Because that's what people were saying. I don't understand how that really could have ended Sway. Uh, I think Sway, like, it started ending when um, that whole situation in Texas happened, you know? Oh, yeah. You remember that one happened, that you know? Jaden, uh, and Bryce. then yeah. And then after, like, we had a re- we all had a reality check on what we wanted, and then we all were like, we're, like we just want different things. Like, I want to act. Jaden wants to do music. Bryce wants to do YouTube, whatever. Yeah. Um, Anthony, I think, wants to do fashion something. I don't know. But, you know, we all wanted to do completely different things, and it's, like, just kind of hard to, like, be in the same house and we all have different goals but then we all have to like work together i don't know it's like it's like having the wrong gears to a clock you know they just yeah. they just it, it can work but it's just not going to work the way you want it to not efficiently yeah so we just kind of were like we're not going to like be forced to make like content every with together all the time it's just going to be like organic so i guess <laughs> sway is just kind of it's a lifestyle. I don't fucking yeah. know, you know? There's That's no, all we can There's say. no label to it. You guys just sway. There's no more label. It's just sway. Yeah. You know? It's just a sway lifestyle. I didn't realize it went all the way back to then. And then people just started living, like, separate from each other. Yeah. I mean, first it was Jaden and Josh, like, moving out, you know? And yeah. then it was uh, then it was me. And then 
uh, Anthony moved and then we got two, two more houses and then we just kind of moved to whichever one we wanted to move into. Um, I am what's kind of odd one out in Sway all the time. Cause like, I don't, it's just, I'm introverted as fuck. So yeah. it's just kind of ways. So I ended up actually going to another house. So we had three houses at one point. That was crazy. You know, the one that Vinny lived in with me at the same yeah. time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And how, how was it? You had Sway, then you had Sway Gaming, right? They, everyone called it Sway Gaming. It was just a fucking house. Like, yeah. it's just a okay. fucking house. <laughs> like, and then, you know, I went back to Washington and then we got that. I came back here for 10 weeks for a job and I'm still here. So Sway is honestly just whatever you think it is. Like, whatever you think Sway is, yeah, that's Sway. Yeah. Nice. I mean, does anyone own it? Is it like a management company that runs it? Or is it just you guys just did it together and <clears throat> created an account called Sway? There's like a comp, we have a company backing us, um, Talnex. You know, oh, yeah, yeah, you guys know them, but uh, Sway is just kind of backed by them and they just get us all our brand deals and we're just kind of vibing now. It's like, is that is that is that how it's paid for too? Like, is like does Talent X like own the house or is it paid for by like the people that live there? It's paid for, it's paid for like by Talent X, you know, like we don't we don't pay for the rent because oh my god, the rent's nuts for these houses, man. (laughs) How much is rent? Um, I remember we when we're on Z, uh, what the fuck is it? Zillow, Zillow, yeah, Yeah. and we're looking at the houses we wanted to rent for the first way house, right? The first way house. The houses in that same area, some are going for like 40k a month. Yeah, just for rent, and we're like bollocks, bollocks, shit. And fuck. Yeah, you're you're you're, <laughs> fu- you're funny. You're funny as hell. <laughs> yeah, like, and then Talon X swoops like, in, and they're like, "Yeah, we got it. That's yeah, yeah we got it." Like half a year earnings, like just that's for rent. Some people's one, full year earnings. Yeah, yeah, that doubles some people. That's some full people's year. fucking house. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> for for a month. That's like, insane. How do you even? That's and you got no backyard too. Like the first one had just a pool, right? Yeah, yeah. Like, what the fuck? You're not even paying for a backyard, and you're paying forty k a month. You don't have grass. I mean, if I had OnlyFans, I could pay for it. But <laughs> <laughs> for real, that's cr- how did Tal- so? How does that work with Talon X? So they, I know that you work with the, you work with them, and do they like they bring everyone brand deals and they work to? Yeah, they bring us brand deals. They work on bigger picture stuff. You know, like they basically just our managers, like in the sense of a word. Yeah. Like we don't ever go and get a brand deal by ourselves. They do it for us. Okay. Because we'd probably get fucked if we did it by ourselves. You yeah, know? yeah. But. They get us the best deal, and they also help us work on what we want to work on. You know, like me acting, Jaden music, Bryce's YouTube. Like they actually help us with what we want to do. So yeah. it's kind of dope. What kind of help are they giving you with acting? Is it like acting classes? Is that um, they they sign me to an acting agency actually, and the acting agency sends me auditions from like Netflix, Hulu, Amazon. Like they give me actual auditions. I'm like it. Fuck college. Fuck college. Couldn't yeah. give me that. <laughs> like that's college, insane. Dude, I don't even get me started on college. Dude, like, I hate college. College can work if it's really what you want to do, blah, blah, blah. But, like, if you if you do not want to do college, just don't. Like, don't waste the money. Don't waste do the not. money. But you do have to, you do have to come up with something else. Yeah, yeah oh, right? of course. You have to be, because the thing is, is that if your mentality is, oh, I don't want to do school, but I'm also, yeah, I also you, don't want to do anything else. If you don't want to do college and you don't know what the fuck you want to do, take a gap year. At least take yeah. a gap year. That's my biggest advice is take a gap year at least to, like, figure your shit out. I feel like people too much too much pressure on the idea that you have to go to college. Like going against it is going against going oh, against the culture. They should just make it like hundred yeah. percent. Like college is like apparently default. I'm like, why is it default? Doesn't make any yeah. sense. Default pay forty grand, eighty grand a like, year. A college degree would have not given me an agency in acting. Yeah. 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 It's Very like, hey, true. here's my master's. Yeah, fuck off. <laughs> like these days it's just paper and debt. That's all you get. <laughs> Literally. Do you feel like uh, so what what was the first thing that really blew you? you up was it like the pov stuff because i know that i, I see some yeah, stuff doing like that. this shit <laughs> just, yeah. just fucking looking at the camera and just like looking up and down i don't know people liked it for some reason even though like i wonder why yeah <laughs> it wasn't even that good it was literally me going like this oh uh, dude like, dude how many takes it, how many does, drafts did you have of that so one literally it would take me like 10 tries at least that's each what I'm, one. yeah and it would still be cringy as fuck. i look back and i'm like what the fuck the thing are you is, is like i love it is like people just get pleased by like the easiest things sometimes. Sometimes it's the hardest thing in the world, and sometimes, <laughs> sometimes the girls are just like, oh, yep, like that. I'll comment. <laughs> even, I'll comment too. You know what? I might even fucking share it. And then, <laughs> Dude, you know, that, no context. What you just said sounds funny as fuck. Like, <laughs> <laughs> close your eyes, just listen. <laughs> I'm after. I'm after <laughs> listening to that back. Remind me to listen to that back when, <laughs> when this is being edited. But yeah, I'm I don't know. Like that's a blue just, My POVs also help. Yeah, but was that was that like what you started with? No, POVs were like, I went from the look to POVs and then I just kind of morphed them together and everyone was like losing their shit over it. <laughs> Dude, I remember my first like blew up, blew up like 20 mil plus views was at the same time when Addison like was first starting to blow yeah, up, yeah. blow up. That was when like, uh, I can't remember the fucking audio, but like I remember the audios at that certain amount of time were like all so fun to make with. Yeah, the, yeah. the beginning of TikTok, I feel like. The beginning the of like, audio, yeah. hype house, you best, know, like everything. That whole s- 
it, like times that frame was so fun. Yeah, I know I fucking hate TikTok. So <laughs> yeah, TikTok is it's it, the only thing I don't like about it is like the algorithm and FIP certain things it takes down compared to certain things it doesn't take down. Like I'll see cer- certain fucked up things on my FIP that isn't taken down, and then most of my videos get taken down for like the slightest thing. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of pertain to bigger creators. Like I post some sus ass shit, like. Mm-hmm. And it doesn't get taken down. And then a girl who has like maybe 5K uh, followers will post in like a, a sports bra and get, it's t- taken down. Yeah. It's and I'm just like, big my whole ass dick is out. And like, <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> I mean, it's nothing the internet hasn't seen before. We were, we were actually talking about. Uh, I hate to bring it back. We were talking about this the other day. We're we're like, wait, who's gonna get the first dick leak in the in the sink? Like we're like, who, who, who would get their dick leak first in the um, sink? I don't let's, know. Let's, let's take our guesses. I think personally, I feel like it'd be Kai. What? I think it. I feel Kai. like you <laughs> sent your dick out to more people than you disclosed. And, and it'd be like on accident through the main account somehow. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be like the most out of pocket Dude, way. I'm not even gonna cap. That's such like a thing. I think of like. When you're sending like a pic, you know, just to someone, but then like you just see, like the the loading bar for your story being yeah, posted, yeah. and you're like, like that's such a feel like that goes to my head every single time I think about it. I'm just like, imagine, just imagine. It's one slip of the finger <laughs> ends everything. It's all over. I I, th- I do think it's gonna be you though. Uh, why? What would you make make you think that I would send a dick pic out in that? Well, mass I mean, I know that, that you have sent dick pics out. It's just the matter, like the like the volume at which you do it. I yeah. feel like you do uh, it at a incorrect. volume. That's incorrect. I've not. That's such okay. a lie. Don't Who the, lie. I think it's whack to send dick pics. Why? Man. I think it's whack to send dick pics unless you are with somebody because then you can't trust where it goes. Yeah, okay. Well, um, but I feel like that's just you like saying. It. I think that you're just saying that for the camera. Yeah. You guys seen Blue Mountain State? Ah, you're right. I send dick pics yeah. to everyone. Blue Mountain State. Remember when Sammy right. he, like sent a dick pic to everyone oh, yeah, every, every single shot morning? From underneath, just face shot every morning. <laughs> every morning will be a different text message from Sammy. Well, the I mean, fact, well, I mean, the fact everyone. that you see his dick on the show is the funniest part <laughs> to me. Like they actually show his dick. <laughs> I mean, if everyone sees it, then you don't have an issue. You'll never have a dick pic scandal. <laughs> I mean, that's how that's how the end of the episode ended. They had a big billboard of all their dicks. Everybody yeah, saw yeah, it. Yeah. They made fun of it. Did the coach take one too? Yeah. <laughs> oh, he, oh, he said it to fucking uh, the quarterback. Yeah. He's like, is this a sign? Like, what does coach want me to do? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that show is really fucked up. Oh, actually. that show is so I fucked up. It kind of perfectly embodies college, though. Dude, that show <laughs> would get canceled immediately oh, 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 yeah. today. Yeah. That's what I hate about today is that like, you can't make a show like that without getting canceled. Even shows like The Office make some jokes that like you can't even make anymore. And it's Dude. only been like eight years. And Have you guys fu- seen Big Mouth? Big, <laughs> Big Mouth is <laughs> it's a little edgy. Have Big Mouth that? is like brand new. and it's I feel like you could be a character in Big Mouth. <laughs> 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 I could kind of see yeah. that actually. I don't, I, know, I don't know where I'd fit in. <laughs> I don't Kyle fuck pillows like fucked up Jay. hormone monster. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, yeah. I don't even know, man. It was like episode two, like the first dick was shown, like episode one. <laughs> like I saw like a what, like. Well, a, it's just funny because at the end of the show, they're like they're like making fun of how like they can do this. They're like, oh, what if like we just make like a show in cartoon form so we can show like you know like what's like what all this is, <laughs> and then they're, they're like, oh wait, that's what like that's what's happening. You know what I mean? <laughs> so it's like, it's just funny how borderline they come up fucking with, hentai. <laughs> you know, literally, it's close. <laughs> it's dangerously close. Yeah, there aren't that many fuck shows out there. I'm trying to think. Like now, other than Big Mouth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I also yeah, don't really. really watch that much TV. I was family, guy. <laughs> family Guy. Family Guy. Dude, yeah. Family Guy is still to this day does oh. not give a single fuck. At all. Seth MacFarlane's a legend. Shout out. Oh. South Park is pretty bad. South Park's pretty bad too. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah we're actually, there are some fuck shows still out today. I <laughs> think about it. Yeah. There are still a lot. And it's crazy because like that's where our humor. That's what we grew up with. <laughs> and now like that we have an opportunity to like show that we can't because of like how the world is now or like how they see certain well, types of humor. There's two types of people in the world. There's people that grew up with South Park and people that grew up with SpongeBob. Yeah, it's two completely different yeah. types because you didn't. It, it's either one or the other. <laughs> I grew up with both. So yeah. <laughs> really, <laughs> yeah. But which you one? The good but you can't make both. those jokes on like on the internet. Yeah, for sure. Oh, God, no. dude. Honestly, SpongeBob is so depressing if you look back on it now because like there's so many hidden messages in there like squidward yeah. just being a depressed fuck working nine to Lonely. five every single day yeah <laughs> you relate to it now you're like oh no i'm squidward yeah <laughs> home depot makes me feel like squidward 
Uh, I want to ask you another question about the house real quick. Um, how does Triller, is, is it the, it's a Triller house, right? Yeah, that's on the Bryce Blake and Noah at. How does that work? So, like, I saw Triller come in like a wave in terms of trying to pick everyone up, but also, like, I don't know anyone that uses Triller as much as they use TikTok. Still. Triller probably would have been the next app if TikTok actually got banned. Yeah. yeah. You know, and we're all, we've all, like, we're all doing deals with Triller, you know, just kind of like, you know, Posting on there. Yeah, posting on there. You know, we're doing yeah. deals with them, bigger picture deals, not really. We're still kind of unsure where we're heading with Triller because we did, like, you know, we want to work with them still. But with TikTok not getting banned, that kind of was, like, a big fuck you. <laughs> it was like, ah. Yeah. Did you see, did, were you doing it before? Like, were they lining up the deal before because they thought TikTok was going to get banned? And just, yeah. And, like, on there early? Yeah, you know, because, like, if TikTok got banned, like, what was the next app, you know? And, like, the Sway Boys were probably, like, the, big, like, the biggest house at the yeah. time. Triller, like you know we're gonna be on triller and like our fans would have followed and then yeah like it was gonna be just kind of a moving app kind of from like uh vine to music to music to tiktok tiktok to triller but tiktok didn't get banned so now it's just kind of like ah it's, it's that was a yeah. crazy Fuck. weekend that was a crazy weekend because it was supposed to be banned like a saturday and on friday i was i made a, tr- a triller and i was like trying to get all my fans to instagram like just follow me it's the last time you're ever gonna see my face again if you, you actually look 60, and then you have 63 <laughs> followers on triller <laughs> yeah <laughs> So what do they what do they like do for you guys in terms of like in exchange of posting on Triller? I don't know if I can talk about that. Oh really? Yeah, okay. I don't know if I can. Because last time I tried to talk about it, they're like just fuck up. And I was okay. like, oh shit, my okay. bad. Okay. Yeah. No, Bang's the same way, I think. Yeah. Well, okay, so I've never done a deal with Bang, but you have to sell your fucking soul yeah. to Bang. Like, so holy weird. shit! I've heard about some of the things they make you do. I'm like, what the fuck? If you want a bank, if you want to sign up for a Bang sponsorship, you have to ent- enter your ch- like your measurements. Yeah, he had tr- he tried to do it for us, right? And they asked for like your measurements of your <laughs> yeah, chest I was, size. I was like applying for a channel, right? On like their, you know, like sponsorships. Or, like, uh, <laughs> they want all your like, fucking bust. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, and they were asking me my measurements, and I'm like, Are you double I'm, like, D's? I'm, like, I'm like, What do you want? You want me to take like an average of the fu- like like we, like you don't want me to take like an average of our house? Like like what are we doing here? It's just weird. And then they asked for like headshots and stuff, and I'm like, What what the fuck is this? So then you just go hit them up on LinkedIn. <laughs> <laughs> go in the back door. <laughs> But yeah, no, like doing those ads, it's like post so much every single month. You got to yeah. show yourself drinking it. it it's a, it's a yeah, talent X don't really make us post multiple. They've never made me post multiple of a single like brand. Oh really? Yeah. yeah except for one, but it was, probably, it was yeah. a bag. So it's always, always like on to the next one kind of like one brand deal. And yeah. It's like usually one big payout for one TikTok and like post on Instagram story. Then it's like next, you know, feed posts are like probably the most expensive ones you'd get from us because feed posts on Instagram have more have a guaranteed yeah. output of likes than TikTok. Because TikTok, usually like a, a sponsored post, like 200K likes maybe, but Instagram is guaranteed like 400K plus yeah. likes. So. That's nuts. 400K plus likes? Yeah. <laughs> how much can you, okay, without, you don't have to say, but how much can you charge for 400,000 guaranteed likes on Instagram for a main feed on post? An Instagram post, at this point, 30K plus. 30K plus? Yeah. How many can you comfortably do a month without... Like, but you have to much. find a, a like a brand willing to pay that much, and a brand that you actually want to sell. Like Burger right. King, that was one I I did that I was willing to do. What's your question? Yeah, I'm saying like how how many can you do a month without making it too much? Because you can make 30k, but if you post, well, eight, usually you know, a brand will not want you to post for a certain amount of time after posting really? theirs. So like maybe like two months, then you can do the next one, or like one month, then you can do the next one. Uh-huh. But of the same brand, so Burger King wouldn't want you to do another one. No, no, of another brand completely. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm, I've never had a brand have me post more than once on an Instagram feed. Okay. But they like they will want exclusivity for a certain amount of time, and then you can do another brand deal. That's so like air out the post of the first one. Yeah, because like it's like if I do a Burger King post, and the next day I do a McDonald's post, it's like, yeah, the fuck, man, <laughs> like you know. I never, th- I never heard about that before. Where on Instagram they ask for like exclusivity for a certain amount of time. That totally makes sense. Yeah, and they also want to keep. They want you to keep the post up for a certain amount of time. Yeah, you know, like they want to keep it up for at least like forty eight hours. Mm-hmm. But you don't. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like ah, okay, yeah. I got yeah. likes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking crazy. I've never had a Burger King burger. Never been to Burger King before, dude. I'm, their fries are so underrated. Their fries, they're slap. good. They're, they're flaky. Fried. Nice. Their fried slaps. I just, yeah. I, I just like. It's like one of those places I've never gone. Never been there. Never been to Arby's. 
Oh, cool. no, nobody's no one needs to go to Arby's. Arby's. Dude, I'll get Arby's at like 3 a.m. in the morning if I'm just dead starving. What do you even like? What do you even order at Arby's? Okay, their curly fries are dope. I'm sorry. See, their no, curly fries are dope. Okay, but it's pretty hard to fuck up curly fries. Yeah. Exactly. Jack in the Box curly fries are good, but all of Jack in the Box. Never mind. I was talking about Jack in the Box. Fuck okay, Arby's. Yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. Arby's. Yeah. Yeah. Jack in the Box is that late night. Fries are different. Yo, yeah, Arby's, if, if you need my help for a brand deal, I'm, I'm, I'm available. <laughs> but after 30 weeks after 30K. Well, it's just like, it's crazy. I saw this thing going around. It's like Arby's has to be a money laundering. A money laundering thing because when <laughs> have you ever what it has to be a money laundering front because when have shut you the fuck up <laughs> oh, i know they're gonna fucking come for me when have you the cartel ever, and arby's <laughs> when have you or any of your friends ever in the world said yo i'm feeling arby's right now <laughs> <laughs> dude they got the meat <laughs> i know they have the meat and they also have the cocaine money maybe that's where they film all the pornos they're maybe? able to yeah. buy so many super bowl ads and everywhere dude TV. i think that's where they film all their pornos that's the only oh. secret. <laughs> You're like meat. that could go both ways. <laughs> they have the meat. But anyway, I mean, I'm just thinking Arby's. No, nobody ever in my life or anyone that I know has ever said, "Let's go get Arby's right now." And I just think it's weird. How are they making money if no one eats there? I mean, uh, probably it's probably like just in different like section of the fucking U.S. Uh, because like Arby's Carl's and Juniors, Sonics, like I never. Uh, it's true. Uh, true. Like, Maybe like the East Coast. It's a fucking thing. I don't yeah. know. In L.A. <laughs> The most densely populated city in the United States. You've gone to every restaurant ever and waited in line, but you never see a line in front of Arby's. Ever. Ever. Not once. I think it's crazy. I've been alive for 20 years. That was my next YouTube video. Like, what actually happens in an Arby's? (laughs) (laughs) I go in there and no one's actually working in there, but the lights are on. Everything's like fake. It's all like (laughs) fake food. And there's just bricks of cocaine. And the the cashier's a cardboard guy. (laughs) (laughs) It's like, what the (laughs) fuck? It's like in the interview in like North Korea when everything's when everything is fake. The fruit was fake. <laughs> they, have, they have like a little fact that fake. comes out as a customer. <laughs> the fruit was fake. No, I just walk into the casting couch. Oh, <laughs> like, okay. There's a lot of different things that happen. That's wild, dude. I think if you do OnlyFans, just go on Pornhub. Like, I think mean, about it. Yeah, Pornhub true. pays bank. Have you seen a Pornhub check? No, I haven't. No. I, haven't but I saw one on Twitter one day, and I was like, the. F- how much was it? Well, I've, heard, I've heard both sides of it. I've heard some people never getting paid and then people actually getting paid well. It was like six figures. Six. The thing that cracks me up is how videos will have 25 million views on Pornhub and like 900 likes. Because <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck has a Pornhub account? Yeah, I mean, shit. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. <laughs> but, so, hey. so what did you watch with the brother? With the um, I mean, I'm not going to get into to, to that. You know, <laughs> who's, your, who's your favorite star? Okay, I mean, you guys tell me first. Lena Rhodes. Lena Rhodes. All right. Because I met her. She's hottest fucking person too. Donald Trump, <laughs> dude. And I want to meet her. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And now, and now, you know, just for this, Kyle, who's your favorite? And Kai, who's your favorite? I don't really have a favorite. I don't really like. Dude, no, dude, no, I no. Saw, I saw Lena Rhodes at like saddle. On the day. I was like, oh, like she's what? bad, bro. <laughs> like, bro, I swear we miss like saddle on the the weirdest nights. <laughs> like Lana Rhodes is there. Well, oh, you would fuck. be fucking pants dropped if we were there when Lana Rhodes is there. <laughs> You'd be like Jonah. You, you, uh, you'd be like uh, fucking Jonah Hill in The Wolf of Wall Street when Margaret Robbie walks in. <laughs> <laughs> She's the fucking hot, bro. So hot. Donnie. Donnie. What the fuck are you doing, Donnie? What the fuck? He just dick out. Dude, didn't she break up with her boyfriend like recently? Did you hear why? Because he oh. cheated on her like in GTA 5. Yeah. GTA 5 role play. <laughs> <laughs> he met a girl and Mike May like meets a girl in, a stri- in the club. I mean, shit. Club. She's single. Yeah, <laughs> they'll be back. They they'll be back together in a week. See this podcast. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, hey, Lana, got a boy here for you. Her, her <laughs> ex was like six foot three. <laughs> like, Dude, Mike. I don't know. Like, uh, he's the only person I know that would actually like lose a girl off of GTA. <laughs> like, how? <laughs> What? You would think of it'd that. Be, no, like who that's, no, that's like crazy. Like that's like losing a girlfriend off of Minecraft. Like it, you be, lost a girl through a, like a video game. It's defeating. Like that's. I, I don't mean, know how you. Yeah. I mean, it could be a YouTube prank. I don't know. It's publicity, probably, because they broke up like four times already. Yeah, they did break up yeah. a few times. It could yeah. just be a prank. But. This one also makes Lana just seem fucking crazy, though. If she broke up with him over. But if you're actually single, <laughs> <laughs> would you ever date a porn star? Because I feel like it's difficult. Okay, knowing see, that see, other well, a lot of, of your close people. friends have potentially <laughs> close seen. friends. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just saying, like, like, like you you're really cool with your girlfriend hooking thing, up with other guys, and not even, even just work. hooking up. Like, there's some fucking vicious shit that happens on Pornhub. It's vicious. Yeah, hey, yo, yo, we we talk about his Pornhub experience. What are yours? 
Pornhub experiences? I mean, I'm just saying, man, there's some shit on there that shouldn't be on the internet. Yeah. <laughs> and that, it's weird. Yeah. And I'm just saying, if that happened to be your girlfriend one day, it, are you okay with that? See, the thing is, I... Okay, don't take this the wrong way. Let me finish before you fucking, like, start going for my throat. I could never date a girl with an OnlyFans. Why? Like, I don't know. It's like... I like, I want that for myself, you know. But if someone else yeah. can just pay to see it, it's like, yeah. I don't know. It's just like if someone, I just, it's not like me saying don't do it. Like do it. Like get your bag, go get it. Like if that's how you make your money, send it. Yeah. But me personally, I could just never date someone with that. It's like you know my preference. I don't know. Is there a difference if they're like solo or like always collabing with people? <laughs> Is there? It doesn't matter, man. It doesn't I don't matter. Know. No like, what? It's the same thing. Hey, yo, peace out, Keo. Going on a collaboration. Like if someone, if someone can pay to see your tits, I'm like. It is, it's not special when you get to see it by yourself. Yeah, I know. It's like yeah. I don't know. It I just that. I have friend I have friends with OnlyFans and I like I love them. Yeah. But at the same time, it's like I could never date them. It's just like I don't know if I I don't know. Yeah, no, yeah, totally understandable. Is it weird that I I think I would be more comfortable dating somebody that did OnlyFans than was a porn star? No, a porn star, you're getting railed on camera. Yeah, <laughs> like, like, even if you're getting I uh, you know, I guess you're right, but like weirdly it's still like a different, totally different thing. You imagine like coming home from work. Yeah. Yeah, but to them, it's just normal work. It's the same thing as when you go to Home Depot. It's not. I'm just saying, you get and work. And it's not normal work. It's not normal it's work. It's normal work that probably 90% of the people you meet don't know that you do it. Yeah. Dude, there are some, Dude. like, porn star, like, channels, though, that don't show their face. It's just, like... We were talking about yeah. that. The yeah. Other yeah. Day. <laughs> like, <laughs> we heard you get paid significantly more, though, if you show your face. It's, like, three times as much. That, that's yeah, like the weird thing. Because yeah, you can put a face to it. The yeah. Google like AdSense is way higher. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Crater Fund on the, on the, <laughs> the Hub. <laughs> the brand deals that come in are so much crazier dude if you guys want to have a laugh go look at the comment section in any porn it's really <laughs> Yo, funny they're really? so like love pol- your work man so polite for no fucking reason yeah. they're like love this really helped me through a hard time <laughs> <laughs> nice just watch this with one hand smiley face <laughs> you know those like sus tiktok comments are like i just i just moved phone into my left hand <laughs> Sai so, grabs size, lotion from side of bed. Sai's open safari. <laughs> Yo, speaking of, our fans have some sexual like tension with us sometimes. <laughs> like, if, like, like, have you seen your DMs? Like, you'd be like, like, I, on my like seventy percent of your people are yeah yeah no, no no on my on my life they're like damn Chris what's in them drawers or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be like what? it'd be like a a, a shrug account only fans for they've asked to they've asked too for only fans for me. They gotta ask you like crazy do though. What do they? What, oh, I mean, like if, if I think I can make a bag, then Kia, you know, sure. Do people DM you all the time asking like for fucking OnlyFans or like what is? Oh, all the time. Yeah, I can probably find it right now. <laughs> like I can probably find it right now. Saying <laughs> OnlyFans. How much of your audience do you think would would buy an OnlyFans if you launched one? Like, have you ever the thought about is, it and the thought thing like? Is, okay, I feel like it wouldn't be my audience buying my OnlyFans. Who do you think it would be? Like creeps. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've met like some it, fans, you know, but. I feel like if you're a fan and then you see it, it kind of like breaks that whole fan <laughs> feel to it. It's more of like a, it gets way too close and personal. Whereas if it was a creep, it's distant, but it's still a creep. Yeah. I'm, I'm like looking. <laughs> <laughs> I just laugh at Chris. I laugh what? at Chris. What? I just laugh at Chris making it OnlyFans and like our fans buying. <laughs> they would buy it. And Chris like thinking it's like some bad bitches buying his OnlyFans, but it's really just like, like the me. name's John Charles. Just, Char- just, just to clip it and, and make a fan post. Out I mean, of it. <laughs> like this is what I mean, like creeps. Like I have a dude saying, "Can I suck your dick?" <laughs> How old? <laughs> Been there. I, I don't. How I don't, old is this I guy? don't know. I don't want to look deeper into it, dude. I, I met a kid, uh, really nice kid, but he does like MadCon. Like he did MadCon before. Like the with the Sean Mendez and everyone, and he was telling me like it's crazy. He gets a ton of cash app sent, but they're not like chick fans. They're all old dudes. But you would think he all has. He only has like girlfriends. He knew straight up. He goes, yeah, dude, it's weird. They just only old dudes send stuff and always try to hit me up. Dude, I've oh my god, I'm so sad because like Olivia, when I was with her, she would get hit up like by sugar daddies every day of the week, and I'm like, bro. I'm still waiting for a sugar mama. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, where? Like, like, when does it happen? Like, I'm like, curious. if you're rich and like trying to just spoil me, fucking do it. Like, DM me. Fuck. <laughs> like, you gotta ask, dude. You're, I feel like you're gonna get hella requests after this. Weirdly, 
Why? Why do you want a sh- <laughs> Why do you want a sugar mama? Like what? What? What are they? I don't know. Like I, if I could go on a yacht into the Bahamas, like for a week, that'd be so dope. <laughs> like come all on. expenses paid. For Literally, real. like it's, so. I like, like I that, wouldn't sell myself. And like I'm not gonna like you know what I mean. Like if it was just like for company, like just to be there. Fuck yeah, fuck yeah. it, I'll go with you. Fuck. <laughs> so is it like is like that like type of vacation she'd go on from sugar daddies or like a somebody like paying for it? I've I've like I have some friends who they've gone on like. Full of va- paid vacations to the Bahamas, Cuba, places like that, just to be there. Like really? just nothing, no sugar whatsoever. You don't actually have to like fuck them. No, they just are there. Fucking sign and to me them, up. they just like to have that like the oldest just, like having like hot girls around them, I guess. But there's no expect. That's okay. That's what I'm saying. Like damn, just being there and you're getting a free paid vacation. I mean, shit. That's yeah. Can't argue with that. Any any rich cougars out there? I'm I'm available. Do all the, <laughs> all the tick. Chris is too. Yeah. Yeah, of course. I'm. I'm always here. We're, we're both available. We're a package deal, actually, if you will. Yeah. Chris will actually pay you to come. <laughs> no. Chris will pay the cougar. No, we're not doing this shit again. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you guys. Chris goes, hey, you want to pay me? I'll do you one. Did you want to get hit up by cougars, Griffin? Oh really? Uh, Griffin yeah. gets so many fucking. He was moms. hanging out with uh, who was it? Um, oh, Osborne. Shit. Kelly Kelly Osborne. <laughs> Did she have an eye patch on? I feel like I remember an eye patch. No, no, she had an eye patch when she had an eye injury for a little bit, but she doesn't actually have one. <laughs> uh, was that real, Kelly Osborne? Yeah. They I were s- actually together? Like hanging out, I guess, but Damn, ooh. okay. But like I've seen his DMs moms. <laughs> oh my god, just moms. Really? Griffin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> kind hey, of to start taking notes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't even get him started. <laughs> for real. <laughs> Was Griffin getting <laughs> explain, guy? Explain. I'm like, what the explanation? There's no explanation. <laughs> explain. How many moms you fuck, guy? <laughs> oh, how many moms have you fucked? He just said none. Dude, I asked waiting. you. I asked you first. I don't know, man. Dude, you <laughs> got it. Don't Dude, be a bitch. Does not need to go out. Don't is it one of their bitch. moms? Is there an inside joke? I'm not getting. No, it's no. <laughs> it's not one of our moms. Kai, if <laughs> Kai, if I explain, <laughs> yeah, if I explain what I explain, you need to fucking say it. Yeah, but like my shit affects my life. Not this, <laughs> not this thirty seconds. Say it within thirty seconds. I guarantee you, nothing will happen. Go. No. <laughs> oh my god. No. Pussy. Pussy. All right. Do you? Okay. <laughs> that first of all, that, that is crazy. That Griffin gets hit up by a ton of milfs. Why? Is it like uh, a? I think it's just the way he looks. He's like older the, looking. He's like the older looking one. He's like he looks like he'd be. He's like twenty. Like he is twenty. Yeah. You know, he looks the way he looks. He is. The, he looks his age. Yeah, but he's also younger, so it's like he's older but on the younger side, yeah. you know. So they're just like, ah, <laughs> time to slide in. Time to slide. Ah. Hey, you should probably take one of those fuck, offers up. Fuck my happily married life. <laughs> Let's slide into Griffin Johnson's DM. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this is some wild shit in his DM. Do we when we like talk to girls at like Saddle or whatever, or they come over, they're always saying like. Dude, yeah, and then we're gonna go to Sway after this. We're gonna go to Sway after this. <laughs> what yeah, you guys are the at, death of us. At the, yeah, thanks for nothing. <laughs> thanks for fucking nothing. We call ourselves Jesus the Christ. They they leap from us to Sway. We're like, like the boom. warm up. We're, we're like, like Denver. You like stop for like, a domestic flight and then go to your actual destination. We're the Sway pregame. <laughs> <laughs> for real, we're transit. Dude, we have we actually haven't had anything at Sway for months. We've been really good, actually. Yeah, thank you for that. You guys have helped us out, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're just sick of getting canceled and our power getting fucking cut. Yeah. I feel. So what, what was the last like last thing that happened there that ended the parties? Was it that one big Pro- big time? Probably Bryce getting the power shut off. That's where the last time we had a party. Really? You guys just don't party at all anymore. Nah, I mean, we're all like so focused on just making money and how we're like. I'm so surprised at how like they just stopped partying. They turn it around, like in terms yeah. of what they're doing. Wow! Like all of us just kind of like. I mean, I don't really like partying at all because, like, me personally, even when we had parties at Sway, I'd be in my room because I just like I'm the type of person where my energy is drained so quickly in a room full of people I don't know, hate. Yeah. You know what I mean? But when I'm by myself, I'm just like happy. Like I have to, I have to want to be somewhere to be, like, enjoy yeah, it. Yeah, you feel like you're forced, forcing. And if there's just there. a party at my house, I'm like, ah, cool. The amount of girls that have walked into my room, like. Like, like surprise, and I'm yeah. just like in my PJs, like, the fuck do you like? I'm playing <laughs> Minecraft or something. What the fuck do you want? <laughs> like, <laughs> like, yeah, what's up? But let a couple stay. Come on, yeah, come, come on, on, on real quick. I don't think I've ever actually hooked up with someone that's walked in my room randomly. I've always been like, like the get the fuck out, like something. Understandable. <laughs> so you you sat out for most of it, but then it was that stuff that ended the 
power shutting off and they've completely turned around so Jaden's work going crazy on music obviously. yeah he's going nuts on josh is doing the podcast josh uh, is doing a lot of things behind the scene that no one really knows about he's he's like good stuff going, right yeah he's going ballistic with that shit what does that look like what do you he's on calls like freaking every hour of the day honestly like what, what he's always what, busy what do you think is his big vision like what is he trying to do well he his goal is to be the first uh influencer billionaire so you know who said that first jake paul he was yeah. like i'm gonna be the first i'm gonna be a billionaire by 24. That's what he said back like five years ago. I guess Josh is the same goal. He's trying to, he's raising yeah. Jake Paul. I mean, he's doing it right. He's working with Barstool. They're one of the most like, yeah. Hey, is, the, that, yeah. is that any drink actually good? I've tasted it. It tastes pretty good. I mean, I don't like energy drinks, but Annie, he's like, we'll send you guys a case. <laughs> yeah. Shit. How much is that, so. that? Is that his business? He's trying to build up any energy, but it's no, that's, just, up. that's just one of the things he's doing. What Josh are, has so many things going on. Like, what are the other business things? Like, I don't know if I can say. Oh yeah, it, of course. But yeah. I mean, you guys, have you guys, like, I, what have you guys, like, have you guys, seen, have you guys seen Silly Bands? Yeah, they're, they're I heard bring, about. They're that. trying to bring that back. You know, that's crazy. Yeah. That I was trouble so that. long ago. I got in trouble for those. Yeah, I feel like dude, those like drug rings started off Silly Bands. <laughs> like literally, like you could like, like it was like illegal trading that would happen. Give with you those. this one nugget. For <laughs> People are like, like selling packs of Silly Bands, <laughs> but they're trying to bring it back, like anticipating that all the new kids will start wanting wanting to wear it again. I'm not exactly sure what they're doing with it. I'm just there for the ride. Like, yeah, yeah put me in the deal. <laughs> yeah. For real. yeah. How many deals do you do like all together as what was before Sway? Like all the guys. Do you guys do like the same brand deals every week? I don't think we've ever done repeats. We haven't done repeats very much, okay. very much but I'm not going to lie. If Corona wasn't a thing, I feel like we'd be doing way more brand deals. We would be doing way more brand deals because when Corona first started and like Sway and Hype were like, at their prime, right? Neither houses were getting that many brand deals because of Corona. Yeah, like it was kind of depressing. I'm like, damn, we're like at our peak and we are making as big a bag as we should. Yeah, because yeah. that's when the views were the most insane, right? Yeah, like we would post a video of us literally just, just yeah. doing nothing, and it would get a million likes, and we're like, what the fuck are these kids like watching us for? We're boring as hell. Like we we're so dry. Yeah. So, so the brand deals missed. Like like I was like. On the down from that peak, you're saying? Well, it's no, same, it's like it started off dry. Like, I mean, brands just didn't. I mean, brands were. It's just like we could charge more when we were at our peak. You know, now yeah. it's like we can't really charge as much. How how long do you think that lasted for? Like that peak of when it was crazy, high power sway. Addison was blowing up. Charlie was going insane. Uh, probably like. Somewhere. I would I would say around the time, sway and height moved houses. That's when it started to go a little bit for like down. Yeah. You know, it was like yeah, it was like a six month run. Or three, f- right? Is that too short? I think six months. It was like yeah, six, six months, months of it going totally insane. During that summer when everyone's joining TikTok, TikTok was growing like crazy, and then everyone was staying at home because of COVID. I think also summer TikTok is just a different type of TikTok. Like summer TikTok, everyone's doing it. Yeah, like literally everyone's doing TikTok, and like everyone's hotter during summer because it's like yeah. tans, girls are, wearing, girls are wearing bikinis, yeah. dudes are like time to go shirtless, and like people are traveling and shit. So I think that's when TikTok is at its best. And that's your advice. Your best bet to get viral on TikTok is a post in summer. Damn, I never thought. Of, yeah, because people are always at Especially home. Especially if you're a girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Especially. Damn. But. <laughs> Dude, there. Oh, man. <laughs> what? what? You have a video in mind, Chris? No, 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 no. I have, I have plenty of videos in mind, but I can't, like, you know. Like, the two it. videos of me and Olivia that blew up, one of them was um at Playlist Live, and, like, I think it was a, a Latino song. It was, um... I forgot to fucking one. I'm not gonna sing it because I can't sing. But we um, tried to do bachata, which is like you know, dance. what's that? It's like um, it's just like it's like, it's like the on the dance with like their hips, you know, salsa, yeah. like yeah, kind of like a salsa, salsa hip salsa. dance or something. Oh yeah, it's a type of salsa. I okay. think so is what it is. But we did a video where like I was behind her and she was in front of me, and like you know, yeah, mm-hmm. whatever. And that shit blew up, and I was like. I guess my girlfriend's hot. <laughs> like, because yeah. like she was in front of me, basically covering me. Yeah. And then we did another <laughs> one like two months later. Harsh reality. Harsh reality. <laughs> two <laughs> months later, we did the same thing and it blew up again. And it was both during summer, and we're both like in our bathing suits. Yeah. So like I'm just saying, bathing suits are the way to go during summer. Also, make videos with Olivia Ponton that also blow up too. <laughs> I feel like girls when they start TikTok is on a different pedestal or a higher pedestal than guys when they first start TikTok. Cause like when a okay like say if a hot girl goes goes on TikTok, her first video is probably gonna get at least twenty k, right? Which like you can't say for most guys, right? All right. Very yeah. True. If she's really hot, then for sure. Very yeah. true. 
<laughs> it's like it's crazy. TikTok literally like they will just see, oh, she's really hot. I'm gonna hit like. I'm gonna the, watch it again. The difference between guy and girl TikToks though is that when guys get fans, they're always girls usually, unless the guy is funny, because then the guys like making jokes and shit, and the guys yeah. are, like following him. But nine times out of ten, the guys TikTok is like thirst traps and shit. So his fans are all girls, and they will legit fall into the ends of the earth. So he has fans, not just followers, fans. Yeah. There's a difference between followers and fans. Like Sway, we have fans and followers. Mm. But some people will have huge followings, like 20 mil plus followers on TikTok. But they're just followers. Yeah, but then like some of the videos will blow up, some like won't. And then their Instagram is like 200K like followers, you know? Yeah. Because they have followers, not fans. Girls... When they post a thirst trap like that, they'll blow up because, like, you know, guys are going to be, like, <laughs> thirsting yeah, over it, you know? Exactly. Short but, term. But guys will move on from girls they simp. Like, the, you guys simp over on TikTok. Like, you'll see another one, like, oh, shit. Yeah. She's also a baddie. Oh, she's also a baddie. Like, there's another one. Here's, you know what I mean? Yeah. So. But what makes it different? Because there's some people like Olivia who have actual fans, too, I feel. I mean, dating me helped, you know? <laughs> Okay, I'm not saying this to be a dick. It's a fact. Dating me helped. Relationships help when it comes to this type of stuff. Yeah, yeah. but she, then she gained her own fans, and like now she's, she was in the hype house that helped her gain some more fans. You know, now she has like her own brand. Yeah, and she, she has fans now. So it's just like finding your niche and finding your like what people want to watch. Yeah, like the Jersey Boys, they have a fan base. Yeah, their fan base is loyal as fuck. Like they're scary loyal. Yeah, like Nelk. This guy crazy. Fan Nelk. Base. They have oh my, like Danny Duncan. All they those can do like, anything they want. Nelk literally. That's what I'm like, saying. If you have a fan base, you can get away with anything. Like Bryce gets away with fucking everything. <laughs> what do you? What's his fan base? Do you think? Is it? Yeah, what even is? Yeah, we were we were trying to figure that out. Yeah. We were trying to figure out if like if like because us we used to like we were like watching Nelk like when we were like younger like we, like we still do but like our teenage guys like watching Bryce Hall or is it? See, Bryce's fan base is probably the most broad fan base you could think of because he has some, like, teenage girls that are fans of him, some, like, five-year-old girls who are just like, oh, he's so funny, like, yeah. who only follow him because he's dating Addison, and then they're, like, you know, teenage guys that think he's funny as fuck. Mm -hmm. But I'd say Bryce's fan base is mostly college kids. Really? Yeah, mostly okay. college kids. And just, like, in dating Addison, he gets, like, her fans, too, which helps, yeah. but his fan base is college kids. Okay. Yeah. Okay, because I think for a while people were saying that like he was making all content for college kids, but his fan base wasn't. But I'm surprised like it is no, not. I don't. I don't think his fan base is like simps. Like my fan base is not his fan base because really? my fan base are all like um, fourteen to seventeen year old girls who like all want a soft boy. You know. Like they I did. They ever make like fan fictions about you or anything? I read fan. I Holy read some shit. of my fan fictions yeah. on my stream. Gnarly. I stream myself reading fan fictions and they get wild. Like like what do you feel like? Oh my god! Dude, one of them has like a half a mil reads. Oh, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's kind of epic. But it's like it's like it's a lot who, of reads. But you like you're. It, it's weird. Okay, like you make a fan edit, which is cool because it's quicker. But you're actually like writing articles, An essay on, on you. Dude, I'm reading myself, railing some random. I'm like, uh, yeah. The fuck, you know, like <laughs> Keo grabbed my hips, <laughs> and then, dude, I was like on stream reading a fan fiction as I got further down. I was like, oh, like in my head, I'm like, this is gonna go so south. Like, why the fuck did I think of this? And then Keo went south on me. <laughs> <laughs> No, we read them with Nick Austin once, and like they were fucking they were scripted. Fucking Let me. I'm just gonna pull up a fan fiction, go to a random chapter, and read like the middle line. This this will be fun. It's creepy. Mm -hmm. You're gonna like look up your own fan fictions after I this. Have, I know for a fact I don't. I don't have any fan fiction. Kyle does that. That's an invitation if you're I watching I to make fan fiction about the Sync Boys and Chris. Chris, you, Chris, would you want fans to make fan fiction about you? I mean, it depends on like what it is. So if, if it's me like fucking killing somebody, hopefully not. <laughs> like, <laughs> what kind of fan fiction would be like the best? Uh, I don't know. I really don't I feel know. Like, like I, I have mostly like like little dudes following me. Right. So I, I feel like you'd um, you'd normally say like, oh, it'd be cool if someone wrote about how they want to like be with me. But then you think like it's probably written by a thirteen year old dude who just watches me. Yeah. Uh, yeah, most of my fans think I'm funny, so like they don't think I'm sexy. Like that's a, that's the type of thing. I don't think I think some of your fans think you're sexy. Um, I mean, I don't think so. I don't think I've heard one. Okay, to be fair, some fan fiction writers are actually like good writers. Yeah. They just didn't add the sex scenes. Really? <laughs> like there are actually some good writers out there that I'm like, ah, but there's the sex scene. <laughs> there's the sex. Like a good story, and then it gets right to the dirty part. <laughs> Dude, yeah, I, I'm looking at these two. The amount for Vinny Hacker is nuts too. 
It's just I saw a you. comment that was the number one comment it's just, on, on one of Vinny Hacker's posts, and it was like, I would let Vinny Hacker fart my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, no, that's fucking funny. <laughs> like, I would. Oh, I would God. Know. This fan fiction is talking about how Andreas forces himself on a girl. Whoa. <laughs> this, is, this is before that, didn't that age, whole situation. That didn't age Whoa. well. Whoa. <laughs> Dude, I mean, literally, this fan fiction is like months old, and then I'm reading it. Like, I read it after like that whole situation happened on TikTok, and I'm just like, "This is so ironic." <laughs> and it's written by a 14 year old. Let me. Fan, what was that like when all that shit fiction. went down? Was it insane. Where are you going, Elena? Andreas says with half a smile. I'm leaving. I tell him with a glare. He picks me up and starts walking towards the bed. I'm yelling for him to let go, but he won't. He lays me down on the bed and gets on top of me. Uh, Everyone starts laughing, and I hear oohs, but I can hear Keo telling them to stop. What? Whoa. What the hell? Andreas is five inches from my face, and I can <laughs> smell the alcohol on his breath. And the chloroform. Um, rape? <laughs> well, just one kiss, and I'll let go. He must <laughs> rape. Whoa, what the fuck? Yo, you guys go way too fucking far. <laughs> Bro, like. Holy <laughs> shit. Wait, who said rape? <laughs> the, 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 it, says, the, yeah. it says, um, rape? Like, literally. Uh, this rape? really didn't fucking age well. No. I mean, maybe maybe nonfiction? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> the author put in at the top of this chapter, she's like, disclaimer, this is, I did not know about Andres before I wrote this. This is just, like, ironic as hell. <laughs> <laughs> she's the, the author is ironic. That's, like. What are you, okay, what are you working on? Are you doing, going back on YouTube, doing stuff with Sway? Um, there's, a, there's something big with Sway we're doing right now that, you know, we're working on it right now. Working for the next 10 weeks. But um, other than that, I'm working on acting. I'm doing auditions. But yeah. acting, like, 90% of the job is just auditions. So, And it's like a game of just getting rejected over and over again. Literally. Over again. Like, yeah. you have to get used to rejection. So I can't yeah. imagine the stress of being an actor, though. It's like, re- like, I can't even remember, like, a paragraph after I read it. <laughs> like, a script? Uh, fuck. Yeah. I have to remember what somebody else is supposed to say. You get to look at it, like, in between, though, right? Like you oh, get, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, see, actually, it's, it's easier than you think because then you end up, like, because the point of act, the good acting is you reply to what they're saying, but you just know what to say already, yeah. you know? Yeah. Because that's how you make it more natural when you re- reply to them. Because it's all about the cuts. So, like, it's from what the character one says, character two is based on how they take it. So, I feel like, it, yeah. How many auditions are you doing a week? Um, uh, <laughs> like, two to three, honestly, sometimes. Yeah, that feels like a lot. Sometimes it'll yeah. go for, like, two weeks where I don't get a single audition, then some weeks it's, like, five in one week. I'm what are these kind of roles like? What 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 do they like? What does like Hollywood producers see you as? Like, what kind of role do they see you feeling? So far, they have not been typecasting me. That's what it's called, and like they cast you as yeah. one role continuously. But so far, I've been getting like a slew of everything. Really? Dude, one of my auditions, I had to pretend like I was getting head. <laughs> like literally, out. Like I was sitting there. I was sitting there with the camera. I'm like, do I just get head? Like, to, so it's like not even acting. Like, so was it like a, like a regular head, or was it like the Glock Glock four thousand <laughs> meme where it's like. Oh, does the script the script says she lowers her head she lowers her head and you close your eyes I'm and like, then there's like an asterisk and it's like give it the one you nut and she keeps sucking face <laughs> I'm like is this a toe curling one or am I just like <laughs> is Ares, Ares curl and everything <laughs> what? dude the be- actually no, I can't say that I cannot say that wait why <laughs> say it I, I will say this off and I will say this off this podcast holy fuck that's so bad okay. So like Was it weird Like having people Like watch you Fake get head Get fake head I I don't know man I just was just like I just did it Then sent the tape And I was like I just sent it in I just did it Fuck it It's over with Was there people there there? (laughs) No you can't You can't do live auditions Right now because of Corona Like it's illegal So you got fake head alone (laughs) Literally And there was my camera was on a fucking tripod. I'm like, uh, like literally <laughs> with the fucking camera. And my mom's like, what the, are you fucking beating your dick? I'm like, no. No, I'm, mom, I'm getting fake head. Leave me alone. <laughs> God damn it. Uh. So like, was it like a, like a bus there? Like, did you use anything like it to simulate a head? Or is this just like just standing there? I just fucking stood there. Legit, uh. I was like, I was just like, imagine you're getting head. Like, <laughs> like, like, like try to act like you're getting head right now. Like. On the yeah, spot. Kai, I don't want to see Kai's Kai, head. Like, on the spot, do it. Like, go, Kai. Like, on the spot, go, try. Go. It's so Vinegar fucking hard. Strokes. Try I don't want to see it. I'm not giving a fuck. I, wa- I want you to do I, it. See, it's I, hard. I, it's I, hard. It is hard. It is hard. Come on, Kai. All right, if I do hey, it. Hey, just roll on back. I, I, you got you to show how you did it. I don't want to. Okay, watch I'll, I'm fine with that. I'm looking away. <laughs> you don't. You go first. This is going to get clipped. Holy shit. Yes, it is. Go. 
Wait, wait, doing wait. It. I don't even know what you're doing. Cut. Dude, cut. I'm going to go all in Just when I do it. So you better okay. fucking do it. All right, let me. I totally no, he made the sounds like, wait, you're not doing it, bro. Yeah, I guess he it- I just pretended like he was giving head. <laughs> Wait, he's going. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Kai goes Hong Kong, Hong Kong. That was good. Like, I don't know. Oh. The f- there's a. <laughs> I'm just gonna ask to fucking act out getting head in front of nine dudes. Yeah. You you one of the crazy thing before? is I'm not gonna do it. So. <laughs> Fuck you! No, you promise. No. Fuck you, Kai. You gotta do better than hot. Okay, come on. <laughs> I do. It's weird. <laughs> I don't know how to fucking do it. All right. Well, you just fucking. All right. You go. You go. Was that was that your attempt? Yeah, that's my attempt. Right. I feel like all eyes are on me right now. I mean, fuck. We, Kyle, you want to try it? I really don't. <laughs> so like, I'm not gonna do. It. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be realistic. I mean, let me see if I can do it. Cause I, you know. I bit my lip in the fucking recording. Like I bit my lip. <laughs> like I did some three six nine three six five days. I was like. <laughs> You can see, like, you got. There's ways you can do this it. Like, how Chris gets like, He's like, no, 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 no. Like, there's ways you can do it. There's the Glock lock. There's like, oh. There's like, there's like, there's like the, there's like the, the when you hit, when you fell down as a kid and you just like. <laughs> Dude, maybe you should be a fucking actor. Yeah, what yeah, the yeah. fuck? And then there's like the give her, give her, give her like it's, I give it like it's like a little bit too toothy. It's like. <laughs> Dude, he's fucking. <laughs> that's convincing as fuck. <laughs> Dude, I mean, like shit. Just, I couldn't. I'll do send shit. you the fucking hey, script. You. Do Chris, that Chris has just never gotten head before, so he has to pretend like he does. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> now we're now we're, now we're fibbing now. Okay. <laughs> and that's him fucking pretending. What the fuck, man? He's a good ass actor, then. Thank <laughs> you, fucking thank you. Yeah, fuck you, Kyle. <laughs> Sign him up. Try. I'm not trying to get head. Or trying to fake getting head. Whoa, you don't, you don't want head? You don't want head? Who I want do head? want head. I would love head. Dude, now? Whoa. whoa. Okay, they're pretending yeah, you're chill. getting head. I'm not going to pretend like I'm getting head. Go. I don't even know, I don't even know like how that even goes. You <laughs> so you, you've never gotten, you never gotten head? head? <laughs> really? You think I haven't gotten head? That's fucking crazy to me. Good. All right. Uh, fuck. What were we talking about? Kyle. Okay, wait. We'll start. Yeah. Kyle, try it. Try it. Try it now. <laughs> like... I feel like it's like you just like throw like a little like smile. I don't even know. It's like oh, it's always dark. Wait, dude, Chris did a good like when too much you only, teeth. You only get head too much dark. Too much teeth. Like, give your uncomfortable face. Go. Give it. Too give much a good teeth is like uh, back grin. No, but it's too much of a smile. It's like no, no, but like that's how I would if if it was too much teeth, I'd be like. <laughs> no, pack it up. If it's too much teeth, I'm just like. Like I'm like trying to be nice. You like, want like, to enjoy it. It's like it's there. It's like yeah. a really bad movie. You like want to enjoy it, but you just can't. <laughs> It's like this movie fucking sucks. Like, I'm gonna go sleep. <laughs> Sorry for fucking sleep. bed. Go to the bathroom. Have you seen that trying to TikTok where it's like, um, it's the fucking filter where it like, I don't know what I'm talking about, and then like the, yeah. the tongue was like, oh, yeah. what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it's like so like the blue like the the blue line comes down and that's when everything's no, elongated. No, yeah, yeah. It's like I was on TikTok one night and I saw Noah Beck do it and I literally turned my phone off and went to bed. <laughs> <laughs> it was like 11 p.m. wasn't even late, and I was like, "Yo, that's where I fucking." Dude, I like I watched it. I like watched half it. And I'm like, "Nah." I tried it. I was like, "I'm like, what the fuck are you doing?" And <laughs> just turned the camera. I was like, "Fuck now." Nah. So, oh, this leads me to my question. I was, I was gonna ask you. Do you follow any of your friends on TikTok? Like, like, is it ever weird to see their TikToks, like, like shirtless from, ones? Like from back and, home or like? Sweat? No, 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 in sweat. Oh well, I follow them. Yeah, no. I mean, he felt, I mean, he watched it live. I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm just saying. Like, is it uncomfortable for you sometimes? No, because we're always all, just like walking around shirtless. Sure, yeah. uh, this is norm. All right. <laughs> like, I wish we could all say the same, but we're not all fit. <laughs> we're not all sway cut. Yeah, I know. It is a, we don't have a gym in our house. <laughs> <laughs> and you guys could literally run two miles around that fucking house if you guys want to go for a run. <laughs> literally just run to fucking somebody else's room, and it's a two-mile run. Stairs up and back. <laughs> it's like a fucking... <laughs> what, what was up with like all the sway guys like just trying to get ripped just... That's fucked the last like six months. Dude, I don't know, movies. dude. I'm like the only one that doesn't want to be fucking huge. I'm like just chill with the okay, you know? Yeah. But I know Blake is like he's kind of he's kind of chill with what he is right now. Bryce just wants to get fucking huge. I don't really know. Yeah, he looks like he's trying to get like Bradley Martin. I think he is because he's like friends with Bradley Martin. Like they're friends. Cousin so. Sarms. Yeah. <laughs> dude. The f- favorite cousin. You see, Ad- like Addison Ray's dating Bradley Martin now, but it's like, <laughs> but he's not six foot four. 
So they're all just trying to get just as ripped as fuck. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, no, I don't know about no. I mean, if I was no, I'd be fine with the way I looked. Yeah. <laughs> like you have like a nice gap year. Like that. That is that is the max I would ever want to be big. Is as big as Noah. Yeah. But what, how did that happen? Because he joined on last, right? But he, he was like blowing well, up. He was people. a D one soccer player. No, I know, but in terms of like joining with you guys and living with you guys. Oh, I, honestly. See, I never had the hype. I was, I was just a continuous growth. But Noah like got the hype, you know, blew up. Charlie had the hype, blew up. It's just kind of like a, a luck thing, I guess. Just like getting the hype. Yeah. Because it's just, it's like the butterfly effect, you know, where it's like one thing leads to another thing, leads to another thing. It's like the hype is the same thing. Like one video of a girl simping over you and then everyone's like, oh my God, it's so fucking hot. Like that's with Noah Beck. It's like, yeah. Like same with any hacker. Like suddenly he just started blowing up because everyone's like, "Oh my fucking god!" Like you're fuck like, me. You're you know? Like girls want to <laughs> suck farts out of his ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but he gets massive and like you just you guys picked him up early and he started living with you guys. And I mean, living with us totally helped him. Yeah, yeah. but I think he would have been fine by himself, honestly, because Noah was like blowing up anyways. But he has like what twenty mil now. Like yeah. dating Dixie is a huge part yeah. of that. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I mean, it's the elephant in the room. Dixie. Like it's just like I mean, that's just a huge. A huge contributor to the biggest family on TikTok. True. When yeah. you become the true. Were you around them? Holy shit, dude. We watched that video where Bryce surprised uh Noah <laughs> with strippers and then called Dixie. I don't know. What, what did you think about that? Dude. I thought that was kind of funny, but funny. also I get why I, I might was, be all fucked. I thought it was kind of fucked. I saw it and I was like, He's so canceled. <laughs> like I just saw it. We well, got canceled by her by by Heidi D'Amelio. I just saw it going south, and I was like, this is not it. Like, Did you hear about it getting planned before? Mm-hmm. Yeah? And then was there no one being like, yo, this might not be a great idea? We all just like kind of like, ah. Like, because whenever Bryce does, like, says he's going to do something, he just, he'll do it, even if we told him not to. <laughs> I mean, Noah didn't fucking know, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Noah would have for sure said no. Oh, yeah. If he knew. Noah would have been like, no, fuck no. But. That's a dedicated content creator right there. <laughs> Noah's just trying to be, <laughs> Noah's like trying to be nice and do it for the camera because he's already there, you know. So like, because Noah's the nicest guy I've ever met. Noah's so nice, but he was just trying to be nice, you know. But if like they asked him beforehand, Noah would be like no. Yeah, I feel like he would just been like no. Because it's like that just complicates shit with with your with your girlfriend. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean tremendously for no reason. Could it really though? If you were blindfolded though. Yeah, it's also like it's an internet prank, so I guess not really. Yeah. But still, just like. Probably makes it feel like a little ick, you know? Yeah. So, yeah. Kind of like when I was literally just out with my friend and then the girl was like, what the fuck are you doing? I'm like, like am I in the wrong here? Like, <laughs> Yeah, it kind of, yeah, it tends to view a bit. Yeah. Fuck, that's crazy. All right, so you, acting's going on, nothing on YouTube that, that you're really working on right now? Are you going to get back? You I'm have like half a mil, bro, and you don't post on that I'm channel, which is crazy. I'm get back on YouTube, but like... I don't the fuck the film, my guy, because I don't want to copy their content. But it's not like I would do that. I don't know. I mean, I did a video where it was like flew to Florida to see my girlfriend, and that shit like did really well. Yeah. And I'm like, ah, my YouTube is literally half of it is Olivia. Yeah, but they're all like a mil, like all. Of I know. You I'm only like, have like eight videos. I'm like, where the fuck do I go from that point? Because like they yeah. follow, they watched it because I was with her, and it's like. I don't know what the fuck I was. Uh, after Holly, that. I, I say <laughs> Holly. Yeah, I know you're watching this, Holly. Holly. Yeah. If Holly made it this far in the podcast, she's a real one. <laughs> Should I just Facetime Holly? <laughs> yeah, Dude, that's one. how yeah. we first like talked about uh, yeah, Facetime. Yo, I, was his, your reaction was so funny. You're just like, like I could. <laughs> <laughs> All right, real quick, we're gonna continue this episode on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. We're gonna do an audio only for the rest of this and we might. FaceTime and see what she thinks of the, the video we did. But yes, if you want to keep on watching, check us out on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. All right, um, everything for Kia is going to be linked down below. Your Instagram, your YouTube, everything. Go check it out. Go subscribe. If you're, a cougar, everything. If you're a cougar, please let me know. Yeah, <laughs> also, uh, Sugar Mamas, we kind of need one for Kia, and that's kind of our goal for this episode. Bring four. Yeah. Actually, just come our way, and yeah, we'll yeah. eventually yeah, yeah. Yeah, introduce we'll you to Kia and stuff. Flood in, we'll yeah. distribute. All right, so guys, make sure to subscribe to the notification bell and follow us on Spotify and Apple Podcasts and Instagram. Leave us a review all right keo seer yeah by the way i thought it was sire for a little bit i know it's seer <laughs> do most people think it's sire cry sire yeah 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 it's all right. we're gonna go do some of these these tiktoks oh yeah yeah after this all right we'll see you guys next time make sure to subscribe peace out guys peace, peace. <laughs>